to my channel, Motivational Marketer, and in today's video, I'm going to be talking about how to create your own website. So you can use this website to have a blog, have your own online store, just promote your own affiliate products. So I'm going to take you guys over to my computer screen, so let's get into it. Alright guys, so I'm going to just quickly get into this, and I'm going to just go over briefly on how to make a website. But if you guys are interested in learning how to make a website step by step, I'm going to leave a link in the video description leading to another YouTuber who shows you how to do a website step by step. And if you guys are serious about making a website, I recommend you go check out that video. And he also has a coupon code for registering for a domain name. Okay, so first before making a website you're gonna need a couple of things you're gonna need a domain name and you're gonna need web hosting so a domain name is gonna be your personal website address and web hosting is gonna be where all your content your logos your pictures your videos for your website is gonna be stored at so my recommendation for this is hostgator.com so what you're going to do is go to HostGator and you're going to register for a domain name. So this is their homepage, HostGator.com. And as you can see, they have different different um, options right here. But what we're going to do is we're just going to focus on web hosting. So you click on web hosting and they have three different plans. They have the hatchling plan, the baby plan, and the business plan. I would recommend you guys to start off with the hatchling plan if you're just getting started with the website. You can always upgrade your plan later on down the line if you're looking to have more than one website and have more features. So what you're going to do now is you're going to click on buy now. And they give you the option to register a new domain or if you have a domain name already from a different website like GoDaddy or something like that you can just type it in right here but if you are looking to register a domain with them just type in your domain name say for example my first website noob dot com something like that whatever is not taken okay so as you can see that one is available and they give you a list of different options for the suffixes so dot com dot club dot site dot net dot online but I recommend just to go with something that has dot com because that gets ranked easier with uh, Google so what you're gonna do now is just scroll down and they have these additional features like domain privacy protection and right here they offer the hosting plan so like I said I would recommend the hatchling if you're just starting out and they have the option of their billing cycle if you want to pay monthly it's 1095 a month or if you pay more in advance the price is cheaper so if you guys are looking to do this for the long term and if you're willing to invest a little bit more money I would recommend paying for the 36 months or any of these other options in between so you would have a, a little bit of a price break but if you if you're just paying monthly that's fine it's two it is 1095 and you create your username you just create your account basically your security pin you enter your billing information your email your first name all that good stuff your payment information and they have all these other additional services like I said I mean me personally I don't think it's necessary especially if you're just creating a blog but you have the option to add those if you want but it's just a way for them to get you to pay more money. So let me go back and 
uncheck these features that they're recommending. And they have a coupon code right here. But like I said, if you guys are interested in learning how to make a website step by step, I'm going to leave a link to another video. And this guy is pretty pretty good at showing you how to do so and he has his own coupon code that you can use to get a discount and as you can see right here it's 2390 which is not bad for a domain name and a web hosting you agree to their terms and services and you check out now so when you check out now it's gonna take you to your hostgator billing page so It's going to take you to this page. When you get to that page, you're going to click on hosting. And what you're going to do next is install WordPress. So you go to the hosting page, you scroll down, and you click launch quick install. And it's going to take you to this page right here. And you're going to click on WordPress. And right here, you're going to select domain for installation and you just type in your domain name. And when doing a website, it does take a couple of hours for a service to, to create your actual website. And you just have to give it a few hours to set it up. And when it's set up, you can start creating content and adding pictures, videos, whatever you want to add to your website. And what I recommend for you guys to do is to install a plugin called Elementor. And that makes adding content to your website a lot easier. So that's the basics of creating a website. So that's the basics of creating a website. And if you guys are interested, like I said, I'm gonna leave a link to another video on how to do it step by step. And creating a website, it isn't difficult, but it does take some patience to do because there is a learning curve. And with WordPress, it is easier. And when you download that plugin Elementor as well, it does make it a lot easier to add content to your site. And with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. Hit the bell notification so you can get notified when I upload new videos. And let me know in the comments what you guys think. And if you guys want to see more videos like this, let me know. And with that being said, I'll catch you guys in the next one.